Hey guys, it's Gary over at Blair Cato. Got a um, quick one today for you. CL100s, contingencies, earnest money. I think we go over a bunch of different things in this podcast. This one's going to be uh, Becky Ashby and myself from the Central Carolina Realtor Association Contract Committee going over these provisions as they are in the Central Carolina Realtor Association Contract. Byron King, Austin Smallwood from the State Association are going to go over what's in their contract and that contract. And so what we'll do then is kind of compare and contrast and ask a bunch of questions back and forth. So it's kind of a round robin of questions on a lot of these matters. Now, look, if, even if you don't use the other contract, you need to know what's going on in these other contracts because you're going to get presented contracts from other marketplaces right now. It's extremely busy. Everybody's presenting offers. So if you're going to offer that's not what you typically use in your marketplace, you know, you have to know what's going on in that contract so that you can discuss it with your client. If you're not aware of how they do due diligence or how you do due diligence, how in the world are you going to advise your client the different types? We're also seeing people move all over the state of South Carolina. So if you have somebody moving from a CCRA contract marketplace into a state contract marketplace, they have different ideas from when they bought a house of how due diligence was, and they're completely different. So you're going to need to be sure to explain to them that when you bought in Columbia, this is how due diligence worked. But here in Greenville, this is how it works because people will have set in their minds of how they did it last time. So you need to be able to explain these differences and vice versa. So I think you'll get a lot out of this podcast. And even if you don't even care at all about any of that, at least you can listen to it to see how your contract uh, handles CL100 contingencies and earnest money, because maybe you don't know that. So a lot of reasons we also have Gary's good news only. We also talk about the free ebook you can get on seller disclosure, which is brilliantly written. I wrote it. Um, and then we also have a little uh, quick take on releases and the problems we're seeing with releases. So a lot of good stuff in there, a lot of quick bites on a lot of different topics. So y'all enjoy this week's podcast. We'll finish next week's podcast with the same topic of CCRA and uh, SCR's contract differences, and then we'll move on to the next topic. All right. Hope y'all have a great weekend.